George Sub CNC, I know you're a dynamic SME, but what is it you do here? Uh, sliding head specialist, we are here. Uh, 20 millimeter and 32 millimeter sliding head uh, machines. Uh, all materials, stainless, mild, plastics, aluminium, brass, mill turn capabilities. And how long have you been going? Uh, eight years now. And you're continuing to grow new technology, new machines? Absolutely, every year now we've grown. We've uh, taken on at least a new sliding head machine every year. Last year we took on two and we're currently getting quotations for our ninth as well. And we've been asked here from Houghton's. You've recently gone across to learn neat cutting oil. Why was this? Houghton oil, yeah, that's right. Yeah, so as an avid viewer of the MTD, um, we saw that uh, other sliding head users had benefited from the oils. Uh, to be honest, we had had an oil problem in the past when we were very early and we moved to a known brand and we were reluctant to move from that. But we'd seen that there'd been progress with, an, with another firm and we, we thought we'd give them a go. And how's it gone? How's the transition gone? Absolutely great. Yeah, the service was, um, was brilliant. It was on a sale return uh, basis. So, you know, take on the oil, see how you get on with it and we'll take it back if it didn't work. And you, you can't really argue with that. So uh, we took them at the word. We uh, replaced one machine only, so we could do direct comparisons, and we got good results. What were the results? Um, initially, straight away, we got better tool life and surface finish. It was our A32 machine. We put a known job on it. We knew it was a problematic job, so we knew what we were expecting results-wise, and it performed for us. So uh, as a result of that, we've entirely changed over all sliding heads and even the Miano machine as well. And have you measured it across any other machines, or were you happy enough just to put it in the other machines? So um, as part of our revamp and moving around, we had to totally discard the coolant from our Miana machine in order to move it. It was a good opportunity for us to try uh, using a mineral-based oil in the machine. The results on there were even better than uh, what we had on the sliders, so very impressed. So you've increased tour life. How about, is it operator-friendly you know, on the skin? Yep, 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 no problem with the odour, no problem with um, uh, skin irritation or anything like that. The other benefit on the Miano is we do a lot of mild steel work on it, and those parts would need to be sort of handled with care and then oiled afterwards to make sure they don't rust. Of course, you don't have that problem now, we're running with neat cutting oil. So presumably, if you've increased tool life, you can run lights out even longer? Yes, yeah, certainly, specifically on the Miano machine. When you're running the soluble, you have to make sure your mixture and con uh, your concentration is correct all the time. With the knee cutting oil, you've got the same performance all the time. So we were running more and more lights out, getting better tool life, and we could get more one man running. So we're really pleased with that. And you've got another slider on the way. That's great news. Is this going to have Houghton in as well? Uh, naturally, yeah, of course it will. Great. Thanks for your time, George, and good luck in the future. Thanks very much, Joe. Cheers. See you again.